Hey Tanani, hello. Nikki Yamsa, Cora English. My name is Cora English, but many of my friends call me Kara. And we are here at the roundhouse of the Konkau Maidu. This roundhouse um, is very important to my people because it is the place that we get to practice our traditions. We come up every spring and fall to have our grass games. Being a California Indian to me has meant many different things over the years. As a little girl, it meant being a part of an indigenous family that has indigenous roots in California. But I carried that identity with me living in Hawaii. I grew up with my mother away from my Konkau Maidu family in a single parent, only child household. So it was very different. I, I, I was surrounded by the richness and the beauty of Hawaiian culture and arts, but I didn't get to experience my own cultural t traditions until I was 11, which is when I first came here to Orville, California, and I was finally able to meet the rest of my family. At that time, I got to learn our grass games and how to bead, and I became an active part of our traditional culture and our heritage, an active part of our Konkau Maidu community. I think that that's when it shaped my understanding of being more than just an idea, more than just the concept of coming from an indigenous people, but what it felt like then to participate with my hands, with my feelings, to be involved. Maidu is a very large territory. We have our northern brothers and sisters up in Susanville, up in Lassen County, and commonly referred to as Mountain Maidu. And then we have us here, Konkau Maidu, which are the Valley Maidu. And we predominantly are Butte County. And then just below us in Sacramento County, you do see Nishnan territory. And Nishnan territory is our southern brothers and sisters. And our languages, are all part of the Maiduan language family, but we each have our own distinct different dialects. Now, our cultures are also very similar because of that. We are culturally and linguistically very intertwined and connected. And for most of us who identify with being any form of Maidu, we consider ourselves brothers and sisters and cousins. In fact, I have cousins who are Mountain Maidu and Nishnan because we have ancestors who moved from one territory or another through marriage. And our, our, our general practices of needing acorns, the uti, the richness of life, our food from the acorns, and our appreciation of sumi or deer and salmon are you know, our staples, they're very core foundational elements of our culture, our food sources, and what keeps bringing us back to ceremony and appreciation of our environment. 